Today we have something really incredible planned. We are going to be overcoming fear using an absolutely powerful visualization guided meditation method. So I hope you're ready for it. It's going to be absolutely amazing and you are really going to love this one. This is Meditate State and let us begin. So fear is something that we are all very much aware of. We are all familiar with it. But not all of us know how to face it and how to more importantly defeat it and eradicate it, to overcome it. That's the purpose of today's meditation. We are going to help create a mindset within you that is going to help and aid you to defeat and overcome fear, whatever it is. People fear many different things in many different forms for many different reasons. You need to be able to identify what it is that you fear, what your fear is. And from that point, we will be able to work forward and work on defeating it and overcoming it. How we are going to do that today is by using a very effective and powerful guided visualization meditation method. So to begin, I want you to go and find a quiet spot. could be in your bedroom or in the lounge or wherever it is. It's quiet, somewhere that you can be at peace, somewhere where you can feel safe. Go to that spot and lie down or sit down or just get comfortable. The next thing I want you to, to do now is close your eyes and just take a few deep breaths in and out, in and out. Just get the breathing going become mindful and aware of your of your breathing and at the same time i want you to begin to clear your mind imagine your your mind is is a tile or a board or some flat surface and i want you to now wipe that slate clean of all your thoughts try and get that slate as clean as possible have no thoughts lying anywhere on top of the slate just have a clean slate a blank canvas make sure your mind is clear so that we can begin with this effective meditation the first step is i want you to identify the fear identify what it is that you fear whatever it may be identify it have a good understanding of your fear in order to defeat your enemy you have to know and learn your enemy well so identify the fear, know it, learn it, be very aware of what it is. Have, a, a, have an absolutely detailed idea of what your fear is. Once you've identified your fear, we can now move on to the next step. Now I'd like you to imagine yourself standing in an open field. The field could look however you want. Just imagine yourself standing in an open area, wherever it is, just as long as it's open and there's nothing around you, just absolutely nothing. In front of you, behind you, alongside you, left and right, just nothing. Nothing to distract you, nothing to shift your focus. It's absolutely quiet and dead. Imagine yourself in this space. Alternatively, you could imagine yourself standing in the middle of a road that is quiet, there's no cars, there's nothing around to distract you or shift your focus. It's just you standing alone in the middle of this road. Whichever one suits you best, you can imagine it and visualize that. As long as you are standing somewhere where you are alone, where it's quiet, where there's nothing around you, there's no distractions, that's what matters. So just imagine yourself standing in the space. Now for this next step, what I want you to do is I want you to imagine and think of this fear of yours. Think of the fear, imagine it. And what I want you to do is I want you to embody this fear into a dark night from a medieval time or maybe an evil Shaolin warrior or some evil or anything that depicts a villain it could be as i said a dark knight it could be a shaolin warrior it could be a 
whatever it is as long as you take this fear and you give it a body give it a shape give it a form turn it into something that you can see and touch for me personally i would imagine this fear as one of those i remember i used to play a video game long ago uh, i think it was called shinobi and there was always this this knight or warrior that was that was evil dressed in black giant warrior that's what i'm imagining my fear as so whatever it is that you want to imagine your fear as imagine it as that embody it and put it into some physical shape and form it could even be a dragon whatever it is put it into that physical form but for this example i'm going to use that evil knight the evil warrior because that's what i'm visualizing but as long as you have your fear in a physical form that's great do that put this fear into a physical form and what i want you to do now is i want you to imagine this this being or body whatever it is that you've got imagined in your head visualize this standing in front of you in this open space it's just you and your fear just the two of you standing looking at each other i want you to imagine and visualize that this fear is bigger than you it's taller than you it looks stronger than you because i'm sure that that's how you feel so imagine this fear exactly how you feel it imagine it in front of you now i want you to visualize yourself standing think of how you feel i want you to acknowledge the way this fear makes you feel i want you to really take in the sensations and the feelings that you are experiencing right now because these are the exact sensations and feelings that we are going to overcome that we are going to beat we are going to defeat and it's the exact way that we we don't want to feel so we are going to use it as a reference point that this is not how we want to feel once you've got that in your head and you are now visualizing and imagining the situation you are in this open Uh, place wherever it could be you are standing there your fear is in front of you in a physical form i want you to now imagine that this the situation has now become somewhat of a battlefield a battleground there is a there's a there's a battle that's about to go down between you and the sphere it's almost like you're in a old western movie where the two two cowboys are standing opposite each other and hands hovering over the guns waiting for the first one to make the move ready to fire that's the kind of situation the kind of scene i want you to to visualize once you have that in your head and you have now accepted that there's a battle about to go down i want you to look down at any of your arms right or left and i want you to see a massive absolutely shiny powerful looking sword in your hand you've got this unbelievable sword in your hand a sword that looks like it was meant for a true hero for someone who is truly worthy of it you've got this powerful sword in your hand and as you hold it you can feel the power of it you can feel the energy in this weapon you feel powerful all of, all of a sudden because now you have something to defend yourself with you have something to use in an, in an in an attack you feel very powerful holding the sword feel the power feel feel the feeling of knowing that you've got something on your side with you that you can use to defend yourself and not only to defend yourself but to defeat what it, whatever it is that is now in front of you you now have that sense of confidence knowing that you have something that you are going to go into this battle with now i want you to look the sphere directly in the eyes look at it and i want you to start to build up a sense of courage and bravery in within you i want you to start to feel powerful i want you to start to feel confident i want you to start to feel like you can take on anything in this world especially the fear that's standing in front of you i want you to feel like you are in control 
and that you can do and beat whatever you want. Build up all this fire and passion and power within you. Feel these emotions. I want you to gain strength and courage. Feel all of this building up within you. And I want you to have belief in yourself that you can beat and defeat this fear that's in front of you. Build it all up. Make it bubble and boil within you till you feel so powerful and so confident that you can't contain the fire within you anymore. And right as you are absolutely fired up and ready to battle, I want you to launch your attack against your fear. Go head first. You make the first move. Don't wait for the fear to come at you. You go to the fear and you make your move. You launch that attack and you give it everything you've got. Visualize yourself being in an absolute battle with this fear. Visualize yourself swinging that sword at the fear. Visualize yourself using the sword to cut through the fear, to to joust into it. Visualize yourself and the sword having absolute control over your fear in this battle. You are in control, you are winning. Visualize yourself in the most epic sword fight battle of all time. As you are fighting and battling against your fear, I want you to visualize yourself gaining more and more control and more and more power over your fear. Imagine yourself winning more and more with each attack that you launch on your fear. And what I want you to do now is I want you to imagine yourself growing bigger and bigger and bigger in stature and in size as compared to your fear. And as you grow bigger and bigger, imagine your fear growing smaller and smaller. And eventually, from your fear towering and being taller than you and towering over you, suddenly now, you're the same height. And after that, you're a little bit bigger, a little bit taller. And after that, you're now even taller and even bigger and your fear is way smaller than you. And eventually, I want you to get to a point where you visualize this fear as being a small physical being that's way below you and you being a towering giant looming hanging over the sphere and at this point you know that you've won you know that you've overcome the fear you know that you've defeated it and you know that you are in control and you are more powerful than the fear that was once more powerful than you and for that final step imagine yourself lifting up the sword high into the air above your head and I want you to come down right onto the fear the blade of the sword cutting right through it and as you cut right through your fear imagine it exploding into a million different little pieces and dust particles it just completely is blown to smithereens absolutely epic ending imagine that It just blows to smithereens. And now as the dust settles and the battlefield clears, I want you to feel that feeling of of pure joy and power and happiness, knowing that not only is the battle over, but you have emerged victorious. You are the winner. You are the survivor. You are the victor. You have defeated your opponent. You have defeated that fear. You've done it. You have done it. You have defeated your fear. I want you to understand that the fear has been defeated by you. You have done that. And as you stand there on the battlefield knowing that you've won, feel the sense of of pride and accomplishment. Just feel the, the hormones flowing within you knowing that you just did that. You can feel like you're on cloud nine right now because you have defeated the fear. Look around, it's not there anymore. What was once in front of you in your way is not there anymore, it's gone, you have eradicated it. 
And even better, what I want you to, to, to do now is I want you to imagine that you look up into the distance beyond where your fear once stood in front of you. And as you look up, what do you see? I want you to see everything that that fear has stopped you from accomplishing or reaching or attaining or whatever it may be. I want you to see that clearly in front of you. And I want you to see a, a beautiful path leading directly to whatever it is that that fear has stopped you from, from attaining and accomplishing and reaching. Whatever it is that that fear was in the way of, whatever it was blocking, that path is now free. That path is free for you to walk down and go and have and reach and just be with everything that you wanted. Whether it's a job, whether it's a new city, whether it's a car, whether it's being anxiety free, whatever it is, imagine that that is in front of you and the fear that once stood in the path in your way, it's gone. It's not there anymore. And why? Because you were brave enough to take it on, battle with it and defeat it. And now you can reap the benefits. The benefits and the fruits are yours to now bear. This is an absolutely powerful visualization meditation that you can do whenever you are feeling stuck, or whenever you are feeling like fear has gotten the best of you. Remember that fear is something that we create in our minds and it's just as we create it in our minds, it's for our mind to overcome and beat it. And by doing this, this exact visualization meditation, you are giving your mind the power and the belief that you can overcome and defeat whatever fear it is that you've created. That's in your mind, you can defeat it. So whenever you are feeling stuck or whenever there's a fear in your life that you need to overcome, that you feel like you want to overcome, I want you to play this meditation and go through this guided visualization meditation session. And I want you to beat and defeat that fear over and over and over again. And by doing this, you will strengthen your mind will strengthen your belief and soon fear will become an absolutely manageable defeatable thing in your life soon the fear will when standing when faced with it and standing opposite it it won't be the, f the fear that will be taller and bigger than you it'll be you that will be taller and bigger than the fear even though the fear may be there you will be at an advantage, you will be bigger and you will be taller and you will be ready to take it on and defeat it. I want to thank you for taking the time to do this meditation. I wish you all the best and may you defeat every single fear that comes into your life. This is Meditate State. Thank you.